I'm going to have her read uh, Malachi chapter 3. Malachi is Mr. Metavi, Metek Smith and Muchli. From 16 or 16? Uh, chapter 3 and just verse 16. Mr. Metavi is Metek Smith and Muchli. Rotsa uplis moshishni, laparak obenert manechi, or suk de psupali, esmis da its ereba mists inashe, samar sorots igni, uplis moshish tatuis, da missi sahelis, monksenebel tatuis. Hallelujah. Amen. So the Lord is he's listening tonight. Anu dre sam sahamo supali guismens. He's taking notice of all of us. Da oelas tual urs guadevneps. And he's writing us down in a book of remembrance. Da mohsenie bis tsign shits er sam oveliwes. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Amen. You know, sometimes I get with ministers uh, just for fellowship and they never talk about Jesus. I think that's a shame. It's it zogjer mohtar var sa eset moziareobash sadats msakhurebi ikribebian da Yesuze ar laparakob da mgoni rom es aras tsoria. We need to talk much about the things of God. Amen. Chven kchirdeba upro meti upalze saobari. Amen. Amen. He listens and he writes it down in a book of remembrance. Is guismens da is mohsenebis tsignshi itser sam qoveliwes. Hallelujah. We had a great service today with Pastor Mirza up at the new church. What's the town? Kareli? Kareli. Yes. We had a wonderful time today. Hallelujah. Excited Amen. about what's happening up there. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. That fan's okay. It's okay. There we go. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Last night we were talking, Pastor Mamuka and Slava and myself. And the young guy, uh, what was his name? Giga? Giga. 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 The Giga. Yeah. The four of us were talking. And Pastor Mamuka said, I'm believing for times when we all see the glory of God. I said, me too. I think those times are coming, they're, they're starting, but they're going to happen more, 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 more. And I was thinking about a occasion, an occasion where I saw the glory of God. Everybody saw the glory of God. It was a few years ago, we were in a big conference in California. There was about 1,200 people there. To me, the worship was the most outstanding thing of, of those three days and nights, the worship. I felt like we were really opening our hearts to heaven and heaven was opening to us. So the last night was a long service. It was great. It started at 7. And at about 10 o'clock, all the ministers said, we want to do a fire tunnel. You know what that is? Fire tunnel. You know what that is? Okay. There were about 20 ministers. 20. One would stand here. Another here. So 10, ten pair. You know, and the people would go through like this. And hands would be laid on them. So 1,200 people did that. My group from Colorado, we were in the last... 250. So we went through it about 11.30 at night. In that group was Haven, my daughter that was here, Haven. Nathan that was here last time, he has the beard, Nathan. Nathan. 
and about four more from my church. So I went through and the power of God was flooding me. And Nathan, when Nathan went through, he got knocked out by the power of God. He's gone, he's out. So when Usher grabbed him by the uh, ankles and pulled him out of the way. <laughs> and he's gone. So the rest of us, we went and sat back at the back. And we were tired, but we were really, really, really filled with the Spirit. And we were waiting for Nathan to come back to earth. <laughs> Suddenly, the people got really excited up here in this part of the building. And I said this from my spirit. I didn't know what was happening. From my spirit, I said, it's the glory of God. So we ran to the front where the people were, maybe uh, 150 people. Now when I tell people this, even some of my minister friends have told me, I don't believe that. And I always grin, I, I think, do they think I'm lying? Why would I lie? <laughs> what was happening was the glory of God was hanging about from here to the top of the ceiling, but the ceiling was twice this high. Uh -huh. And it was a black ceiling. It was raining up, upwards, gold dust, gold flake. Yes, amen. Raining, raining, raining. Now, my daughter Haven, she's very sharp. She said, Dad, check all of the air conditioning vents because people back at our home church will say, was it coming out of the vents? We checked all the vents, it wasn't coming out of the vents. It began to move across to the back. Suddenly, we were not tired. <laughs> we were like we were like little children. And everyone began to sing. The song that was playing when this happened was Kim Walker Smith, Show Me Your Glory. They were that was playing from the sound booth. Because the band was gone. It was late. And God said, okay. <laughs> so it got thicker, thicker, thicker. It began to move this way. It wasn't coming down. It was staying up. I had on a black... Uh, Jacket like this one. And my daughter Haven looked, she said, Dad, look at your jacket. It was covered, covered. Hallelujah. Wow. Hallelujah. <laughs> Suddenly this happened. Um, a swirling like cylinder, you know, cylinder. About mm, 12 feet long. 
12 feet. How many meters is that? Oh, 10 meters. No. And about cylindry shape, na. This wide. Begin Begin to spin right here, right over the platform. Thick, like bees. Dairogorts titkos bu mister mister kiam. Put krebis bude ay seerta trialeda. And I, you know what I thought? It's going to form into an angel. But it didn't. It just exploded. Hallelujah, hallelujah. That's on YouTube. They got that night on YouTube. It's in October 2011. October. So we went back to the hotel room. I still had that gold on me. I took my jacket off and I hung it really carefully in the closet, real carefully. <laughs> when we woke up in the morning to go to the airport, I looked in the closet. It was all gone. I checked on the carpet. Nothing. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Wow. So when I got back home, I called my old British mentor. He was called the glory man. He always preached about the glory of God. When he was in his 20s, he lived with old Wigglesworth, Smith Wigglesworth. So my friend is in heaven now. His name is Arthur Burt, B-U-R-T, Arthur Burt. And he was in Wales, the country of Wales. I called him. I told him what I just told you. He was 99 years old at that time. He preached until he was 100. Full time. Full time so I told him about the gold glory. I said, have you ever seen that before, Brother Arthur? He said, no, but that was God. He said, we're going to see many, many things like that as we get closer to the Lord's return. And I believe that. There's a sister that has a, an outreach cafe in northern England. It's a cafe. It's in the city of Chester. I've been there two or three times. And she does this cafe in one of the kind of rough part of town. When, when people come in, they look to pray for those people. Healing, salvation, whatever They've seen many people healed and saved in the cafe. She said, we started having these three gang members kind of hang out outside the cafe. Gang, you mean gangsters? Gang, yes, gangsters. And we began to pray for them. She said, one day I noticed they were out there. And when I turned and looked again, here's what happened. A cloud came down upon those three guys, the glory of God. She said they dropped to their knees. She said, I ran and got in the cloud too. 
მე გავიქეცი და შევედ მეც შევედი ამ ღრუბელში they said what is this we've never felt anything like this და ამ სამმა კაცმა მოთხრეს რა არის ეს ეთი რა მე არასოდეს ეს გვიგრძნია she said you're in the in the thick presence of god you're in the glory of god მამ ქალმა უპასუხა თქვენ ღმერთის თან ღრმა თანდასწრებაში ხარ ღმერთის დიდებაში ხარ they said what do we do და ამ კაცებმა მოთხრეს რა უნდა ვქნათ she said surrender to jesus თავი მიუძღვენი იესოს okay how do we do that კარგი როგორ გავაკეთოთ ეს and those three gave their lives to the lord და იმ სამ თავისი ცხოვრება უფას მიუძღვნა with a little help from the glory of god რა პატარა დახმარება იყო ღმერთის დიდებისა hallelujah hallelujah let me tell you one more story მოდი კიდევ ერთი ისტორიას მოგიყვებით if the if if testimony should blow our mind you know things that god does it should blow our minds it's it um damotsmebebma chkua unda akhadon ghmertis didebam goneba unda akhados amen i learned a lot from kenneth hagen you remember kenneth hagen he's in heaven uh kenneth hagen i khom gakhsot me bevri rame makhsos masse i heard him tell this testimony da makhsos ertkhel i am damotsmebas uziarebda guiziarebda he said when i was pastoring a church he said one time i got to the end of the message and Just was getting ready to give a uh we call it altar call for people to be saved. Da qoboda ro ertelat rotsa msakhurebas ay eses sa vamtavrabdi da motsodebas vaketebdi ro monaniebisa. In ran a young man he just burst in and he ran down the middle aisle. Iqo akhalgas da bichi romelits gamovarda da ay gasasuleli shuit gamovarda tsin. He looked like his hair was just electrified electrocuted da ise gamoiqureba titkos tmebi ais elektrod daqenebu qalqza he said help me help me help me qiro da damekhmare 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 brother hagen said what's happening what's happening zma hagen mautkha ra khteba ra mogivida the young man said i was taking a walk da makhalgaz da bichba tkva ubrot mivseirnebdi Suddenly a ball of fire came right over the top of my head. Da utsep tsetskhli gadmoida ayak chems tavze. And it began to move and I moved with it. Daitsqo mozraoba am tsetskhma da mets am tsetskhtan ertad davitsqe mozraoba. We went for two blocks. Ori ubani gaviaret. Then it turned right. Mere marjnev sheut shetrialda. Then it came into this building. Da mere shemovida ayam shenobashi. And here I am. Da ayager var mets. And brother Hagen led that young man to the Lord. Da zma Hagen ma es es akhal gazda Jesus tan Christes tan moiqana. I like that kind of stuff. How about you? Me montsos es ti ragatsebi tkven. I like that. Me montsons. Hallelujah. I say with the Spanish, mas señor, mas more lord, more, more, more lord. Es panurat vambo. U me prometi upalo, u prometi. Hallelujah. So really 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 fast. Ase rom tshkara rom vtkvat. I want to preach and pick up where we left off last night. Minda vika da go da gavagzelo ikidan sadats gushin gavcherdit. We were talking about Father God as a consuming fire. He's on fire. Chven vlaparakobdit rom mama gmerti aris mtsveli tsetskhli, igi aris tsetskhli. We know that from two places in the Bible. One is Hebrews 12:29. Our God is a consuming fire. Da erti es vitsit Biblis ori adgildan erti ari Hebraelta tsignshi sadats natkvamia rom gmerti aris tsetskhli mtsveli tsetskhli chameli tsetskhli. That fire destroys everything that's not of him. Hallelujah. Da es tsetskhli anadgurebs qvelaferi rats misi nebisamebra ar ari. And that fire strengthens everything that is of him. Da es tsetskhli adzlierebs qvelvelive imas rats So I tell Christians, do not fear the fire. Embrace the fire. The Christian is well known to be no gashin yet. It's clear. Chai chut at this. It's clear. It's only going to do good for you. The es it's clear. I'm called Karz Gagi Ketert. Hallelujah. Jesus is on fire too. He's just like his father. Yes, so it's clear. She has been there. And he is Tawisi Mamis Sam's Gausia. I'm going to have Sister read the Revelation chapter one. Come and chat with Sister Wally. თავიდან წავიკითხავთ აა starting at verse 12 მე 14 ე მუხლიდან true let me look this is what the resurrected jesus looks like აქ გვეჩვენება როგორ გამოიყურება გამოიყურება მკვდრეთით აღმდგარი ქრისტე 12 through 17 chapter 1 12 through 17 hold on a second revelation 1 გამოცხადების პირველის 14-დან მე 17 მე 17-ეს ჩათვლით მე შეიძლება 
Yes, just read the whole thing. Mi brundi rom damena khakhma romelit mela parakeboda da mi brunebisas vikhile shvidi okros na sasantle. Shvidi sasantli shuashi vikhile mzgavsi katsi katsis dzisa romelsats emosa mosas khami da gulmkerdze okros sartqeli ertqa. Misi davi da tmebi tetri iqo rogorts tetri matqli rogorts tovli. Tuale bi misi rogorts cetxlis ali, misi pechebi rogorts moel vare spilenzi, rogorts kurashi gavar vare boli, misi chma rogorts bevri cetxlis chmauri. Marjo na xel shej ira shvidi varsklavi, misi piridan kamodioda orlesili. Maxoli misi sahi rogorts mze tavisrul zalashi iqo. بودشی زالشی روم آنها تبس رضا ویخیل ایگی کوداری وید داویتی میسپخت من تAVISی مارجنا داماد دامید خرا نوگشینیا میوارب ایرولی داوک آناسکنلی. هاللویا هاللویا. Jesus is on fire too. یسوع تصلشیا تصلوانیا. I want to tell you a testimony about my friend David Hogan. I've been talking to Pastor Mamuka. David David would like to come if it all works out. مام تقریبا مامو کسیلا پارک ابودی تقریبا دیوید هوگن زیرو مثل سرولیاکس روم چامو ویدس تو گاموا. He was sent by God from Louisiana, a state in America, Louisiana, down to reach the tribes, the Indian tribes of Mexico. They've those tribes have kept the gospel out until recently. Da igi Louisiana statshi sahurob da still ob daro mitzdomo da Indiel tomevs rom lebits. So it's a dangerous area. Minda gitratro es sashishi teritoria adgili. Lots of witchcraft. Ah, zalian bevri ai jado krobebi. Violent people. Ah, zalian muzala de khalchi. David says it's not unusual to come on a scene where maybe fifteen people have been beheaded. Fifteen. That's where God has had him for 40 years. To start new churches. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I like him. I like him. When I'm around him, I'm just kind of like... I like him. Radesets mis mas tan ertat var es siamovnes mas mis gortchi qopna. So he said we wanted to start a church in a new area where there were no churches. Da mitkha ro gwindo da dagwetsqo eklesia iset adgilas iset teritoria sadats ar iqo saertot eklesia. And we knew that area was controlled by a strong man witch a warlock. They call him warlock. Da vitso dit ro ek teritoria kontrolireba di iqo ai katsi jadokarit. This man was about 45. He had two sons in their 20s. They they also were warlocks. Da eskatsi es jadukarik at amas avda ori vaji romelz da khobit otsit li sebi qnen da es bich ebi qnen jadukrebi. So this warlock, this warlock sent word to David and his group. Da ayam mama jadukarma am David's gaugzana gzaunili. We're gonna fast the witches. We're gonna fast 30 days. And come against you with our power. They do have power. Ola jado karvin sakwart. Ola viman khulept. The shenst inagdek chweni zalit gamo walto. The am jado krep zala gachniat. But nothing compared to our God. Magram radkmo dar es zalar shedre ba chweni gmerti zalas. Hallelujah, Hallelujah. Amen. And they have no authority over us. No authority. Dama tarane zala uple bar gachniat chwenze. So David said, Oh yeah. We're going to fast for 30 days. The David Mautra Martla, Chuen Viman Hulep Tots Dat address. So all of his missionaries and the wives, they begin fasting. The Oelam Sahurma, the Sahur Tat Soleb Medaits was Marqua. On about day seven, the Dahlot Mishri de Dress, two of David's young missionaries came together with the two sons of the warlock. Da da tremsi David is orim sahuri shechuda ayam jad mama jadokris orzes. They broke the power of the devil over the two sons, and the two sons got saved. Da morman sahurma 
დაამსხვრიეს ეშმაკის ძალა ამ ორ შვილზე და იმათ მოინანიეს და მიიღეს უფალი. ჰალელუია. ამინ, ამინ. So that made daddy warlock furious really mad da es mama jadokhari zali aman mama jadokhari zalian gaabraza da zalian gaghizianda he disowned his two sons he said if you come on this land you will be killed da tavis sorzes utkhra anu gariqaut da utkha tu am mitsaze am khalakshi mohvalt orive mokluli iknebit So David and his men said no no you come live with us. Da David ma da misma msakhureb mautkhas am bichebs ara ara tkven chventan ertat modikhart. And he said we begin to disciple these two men for hours. Da tven dawitsqet am bichebis motsikul motsikuleba stavleba saatobrivat. Every day. Qovel dghe saatebis manzelze. During the fast. Ay am markhvis periodshi. One of David's scriptures that he teaches all of his new believers is Matthew 10:7 and 8. Da David di tavis qela akhal mortsunes mates 10 7 da 8 astavlis. And as you go Jesus says preach saying the kingdom of heaven is at hand it's close. Da rotsa tsakhvalt utkhalit mogi akhlovdat satasasupeveli. Heal the sick Gankurnet avatqopebi Cleanse the lepers Gant mindet ketrovnebi Raise the dead Aghadginet mkutrebi Cast out devils Da gandevnet eshmakebi Freely you have all received that Tavi suplat mi iget Freely give it Tavi suplat gaetsit So they teach the new believers to do that Da akhal mortsunebi samis ketebas astsavlidnen Hallelujah hallelujah Amen The fast continued Markhva gzeldeboda Here's what happened on day 30. Da ai ra mohta 28 dges. On day 30, Daddy Warlock suddenly dropped dead. He died. 28 dges es mama jadokari mkudari daetsa dzirs. Mokuda. Now David's very transparent, he's very honest. Da David yari zalian alali irdapiri. This wasn't the right reaction. Da es ari qo stori reaktsia. But these are fierce 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 people. Magram ai es daundobeli adamianebi. And David said this was my instant reaction. Da David ma tkva ro es iqo chemi pirveli reaktsia. When I heard my enemy had died, I began to praise God. Rogotsa gavigone ro chemi mteri mokoda khmertis gandideba David tsqhtunva. And my man that brought me the news he said wait David wait Da mama katsma romelmats es ambavi momitana iman mitkha da itsa de dato David gacherdi Let me tell you the rest of the story Modi istoriis danarchen natsels mogiqebi The warlock was raised from the dead Ai es jadokari mama kudredi taghdga He said who did that Who did that Mtsqes da David ma tkva vin gaketa es They said his youngest son. Mis ma upros ma vaji shilma. Ah, hallelujah, hallelujah. He's wow. been a Christian three weeks. Sami kuiris Christiani ikos bici. When he heard his daddy died, he rushed to be with his dad. Da rotsa gai gona ro mama garda etsola gavarda mama mistan. The dad had been dead five hours. Mama khuti satis mkudari iko. Your dad is your dad no matter how wicked he is. Amen. Nishnelo barak rogo rauden borotuilia mama sheni mama sheni mama shenia. The son got on his knees took his dad in his arms. Shvili mukhlebze daetsa mama chai khuta. And begin to command him come back in Jesus name. Come back. Ubrzaneb da dabrundi Jesus sakheli dabrundi Jesus sakhelit. And that he warlock came back. Da mama jadokari dabrunda. David said I have to go see him. Da David mtsqems ma David ma tkva ro pastor ma David ma tkva ro unda tsavidev nakho. So David drove to this man's property. Ase rom David hi gaemgzavra am katsis satsxorebelshi. Came through the gate. David said this is good. Normally the man would shoot him. Sha shevida mis chichkarshi da chveul dghes es jadokari katsi mas miasikudilebda. He walked up to the door, knocked, said this is David Hogan. Shevida da karze miukakuna da utkhra David Hogeniak. He heard a voice say, come in. Da gaigona khma shemodi. Here was the man sitting in a chair. Da ikiqo mama katsi romelits kamshi ijda. David said I pulled up a chair. David sat right across from him. Mi avigres kami da ujeki pirdapir mis pitsin. I told him talk to me. Da vutkhari me laparake. Tell me what happened. Mitkhari ra mokhta. He said well I did die I died. Da tkva Well, me mokudi. He said I came out of my body. Chemis khaul da namovedi. 
But I stopped in the air. Magram hairshi gauchede gaucherdi. He said suddenly. Da molodnelad. The brightest being imaginable. He appeared before me. Now this man can't read. He's never, he can't read. He doesn't have a Bible. He hates everything Christian. David said, what did he look like? He said his head and hair were white, brilliant white. He was dressed in white. He had a gold band around his chest. David said, what else do you remember? He said, oh, his eyes. His eyes were like my wife's coals when she's baking bread. Hot, fiery eyes. So David goes, uh-huh, uh-huh. What else about him? What else? He said, oh, his feet. They glowed like my machetes when I have them in the fire. What? Uh, my short knives. Ah, I have them in the fire. David said, uh -huh, uh -huh. David knows who it is. And you, and you know who it is. Amen. Amen. David said, what else? He said, oh, his voice was so loud. Like our rivers during flood season. David said, did he say anything to you? The man humbly said, yes. What did, he, what did he say? He said this. I love you. He told the warlock. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. These kind of testimonies help us see how God sees other people. God knows they're all redeemable. He can save them all. Amen, amen. Hallelujah, amen. hallelujah. So David said, I was amazed. He said, that man became a member of the new church we planted there da, in, in his old territory. I said, David, is he like a leader in the church? He said, no, but he brings a lot of people to church. Hallelujah. And David said, sometimes when I'm in that area, I'll just go to see him. And I just pull my chair up and just sit and stare at him. And I'm amazed at the power of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So David learned, don't give up on anybody. Don't give up. So God, God, everything about God is fire. Our God is a consuming fire. His son Jesus is on fire. His eyes are like flames of fire. We know the Holy Ghost brings fire. On the day of Pentecost, it was a baptism of 
Him, the Holy Ghost, and fire. Ormus da miate tres moch da eklesis monatula da sulit min disgad mosla tsetzchlit. So Father, Son, Holy Ghost, they're all on fire. Anu mama ze da sulit min da samiwe tsetzchlovania. We talked last night about the angels of God. In Hebrews 1:7 it says about the angels. It calls them ministering spirits, flames of fire. Flames of fire. Uh, one seven, right? Uh -huh, one seven. Yeah. In the book of Jeremiah, fire is mentioned 42 times. Hallelujah. God tells Jeremiah this in 23:29. I'll just quote it. Jeremiah 23, 29. God says, is not my word like a fire. In 5:14 of Jeremiah, God tells Jeremiah this. I am making my words in your mouth fire. Hallelujah. Amen. Father, Son, Holy Spirit, angels, Word of God, fire, 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 fire. Hallelujah. This gospel is a gospel of fire. One old preacher said this. A lot Less people would go to the fires of hell if the church was more on fire. Zalian Brewri Adamiani Nakalebat Awido that Jojoheti Setshi to Ecclesia Iknebo that said Slovani. And I say, yes, sir, yes, sir, yes, sir. Damebi Diak Batono, Diak Batono. I learned a lot from the old preachers because they were on fire. And I believe that's God's purpose for us. I believe we're the end times church. Jesus is coming for us. Hallelujah. He's going to anoint us with great fire. The glory of God is usually is accompanied with fire. Not always, but usually. It says this in Exodus 24, 17. The sight of the glory of the Lord was like a consuming fire on the top of the mountain. Now the Old Testament people were afraid of that. But we're new covenant people. Uh, uh, and we can boldly come into the presence of God. Let his fire come on you regularly. Hallelujah, hallelujah. In the Old Testament, a fire always fell when a sacrifice was offered. Leviticus chapter 9. Read that one, okay? Chapter 9, verses 23-24. Notice this. Here's another glory of the Lord. Appearance. Leviticus 9, 23, 24. 24, 9, 24. Uh, 9, Leviticus chapter 9. Sami Da 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 gamoit da uplis di debam tel khalks. Da gamovi da tsetzhli. Uplisagan, the dads was as herp loses rule 
ვლად დასაწველი და ქონი და იხილა მთელ მახალხმა და ყიჟინი დასცეს და პირქვე დაემხნენ Notice it says the glory of the Lord appeared to all the people. Da uratreba miaktsiet ro natkvamia ro gmertis dideba mtel khalqs evlinao, kamo evlina. And out came the fire that consumed the offering. Da tsetskhli gadmovida da datsva samsvarploze rats ki iqo. Under the New Testament, you're the temple, I'm the temple, we're the temple of the living God. Ahali yaktkamistan akhmat shen 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 da chven qela ni ward gmertis tazari. Hallelujah. And also, we're the offering. The as we chain words from square plates. Romans 12, verse one says. Roma elta torment iserti. Present your bodies as a living sacrifice. Gweub ne barom miunz ganit tkueni schaule birogor tsots halim square plates chest iret. If you'll do that, the fire of God will come upon you. Datut kuen amesgak etet dhmerti tsets chli gadamovat kuenze. Hallelujah, Hallelujah. Amen. It also said this in the Old Testament. Said. As we zuelacht kamashinat kuamiam. On the altar in that temple, there's to be a continual fire burning, a perpetual fire burning on the altar. Leviticus 6:13. Giz giz eb de sam sxol ploze da ar chakres. And that fire should never go out. Da ayes tsets khli arandros ar na chakres. Let me ask you a question. Modit ert kitwas da gisvamt. Who kept the fire going? Whose responsibility was it? Visi valdebule ba iqo rom tsets khli tsets khli qoveltvis entoboda. The priest. No entos. Amen the priest. Sakhuri. You're a, you're a king and a priest unto your god. Sorry. You're a king and you're a priest unto your God. That when you met this at least, when heart me pebi, that when heart mudulebi. You're the priest. Sahurebi. Of the temple. When heart at adrebi, sim sahurebi. And in that temple is the altar of your heart. Da ayam adrebshi aris when you gulebi sam shorplo. And you can keep that fire burning. Yes, you can. That when shegizliat romes setzli mudamentos. Hallelujah! 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 Amen. You remember what Jesus also said in Revelation. Chapter three. He said, "Either be hot or be cold." He said, "Don't be in between." If you're in between, what did he say? How many of you like to watch people throw up? I, I still don't like that. <laughs> I don't like that. Amen. How much more so with the Lord Jesus? <laughs> so, Lord, I say hot, 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 hot. Hallelujah. Amen. A fireless gospel is not true to the nature of God. A fireless gospel. Sahareba, Hamertis Mosat on Yararis. And a fireless Christian isn't either, amen? Da Setzlis Garesh, Christian Utset Slot, as a Yarari Soplisatis Mosat on it. If you agree with me, say this. I say no to lukewarm. I say no. Tu metahma bit quit, Uars Vambo Provi or Nilt Billy. I say yes to fire, the fire of God, amen. Mehmetis Tet. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Amen. God can cause you to look like fire. He can cause you to radiate fire. He can cause your church to radiate fire. All of you together. Wow. Hallelujah. Amen. I was preaching the same message in cowboy country, Wyoming. Uh, the end of May. Maisis bolos a igive exam nils kadagebdi kavboe biskuer anashi which state? Wyoming. Wyoming. Uh huh. It looks like that's where they made all the cowboy movies you watch. Ano kuel a pilmi kavboe bze tu ginachia trats ki ginachia tika kadagebole. That's what it looks like. Da ay get gamoi kureba. And toward the end of the message, I said this. Da ay chemi nesi kadage bis bolos es vutkare. I said God is going to make your church radiate. Gmerti tkue neklesias radius radiatius an tetslovans gaktis. I said supernaturally, He's going to draw people in. Zebu nebriwat is halks moiqas tkue neklesiasi. Fire always draws people. Tetsli kovel tu sizi daus adamianet. Hallelujah. Amen. 
Then I said, anybody that wants increased fire, come up over here. When I said that, a stranger, a young man, 20, 21 years old, he came in. 29. I looked at him. I knew he was high. He's on drugs. I knew. And I got a big smile on my face. I knew God has got him. God has got him. He's got him. Hallelujah. <laughs> so here he comes. He looks bewildered. One of the guys that travels with me a lot, one of my elders, is Charlie. Charlie saw it too. This church has a new pastor. Charlie is a wise, he's a wise elder. He said, Pastor, let's minister to this, this young man. Charlie could see he's, he's got a devil or two on him besides being on drugs. Here's what this young guy said. I need help. I don't know what to do. I need help. I don't know what I'm going to do. I need help. I can't go on like this. I need help. I need help. He just continued. I need help. I need help. I need help. You're almost like Charlie got in his face and got like eye you do it? Yeah, or? Pastor, you do ah, it. I'm and it took, took the pastor a little while, but he got the young man free. Hallelujah. Amen. Now, when he, was, when he got free, the guy still looks like, you know. I gave him a big hug. I gave him a big hug and just hung on to him. He was taller than me. Just hug this big cowboy. I said, you need to stick to this pastor like glue. You need to be under his wing. You won't make it if you don't stick with him. And the pastor's listening, nodding his head. All right, hallelujah. Now, we asked that guy, tell us your side of the story. What, what were you doing coming in like that? He said, I drove by here and something got a hold of me. And I knew I had to turn around, go back. Somehow I knew I have to go in there. I said, well, you know why now, don't you? He said, yes, sir. He said, it's been kind of an intense night. That's what he said. It's been kind of an intense night. He said, I'm going to go home and rest. I said, okay, you come back tomorrow night, yes? The next night he came back. He looked much better. The next day was Sunday morning. He looked completely transformed, completely, 100% different. And he asked if he could work in the sound booth. He was a technician. Can I work in the sound booth? They said, sure, sure. Hallelujah. What do you think got him in there? The power of the Holy Ghost. The drawing power of the Spirit. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. 
Now the more we open our hearts up to God like that as a congregation, all of us, all of us. Da rotsa upro met ada es upro gavulgebt gmerts guls ogon qelani ertat rogorts eklesia. The more that things like that are going to happen. Ras upro met ad gavulgebt mit upro mokhteba eseti ragatsebe. God notices. Gmerti am khedaus. God responds. Da gmerti pasuks ktsems. He'll do supernatural things. Da zebunebri ragatsebs gaaketebs. It's much more exciting that way. Da bevrat uch upro agma ptovan nebelia rots asakhteba. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Let's finish this fire message. Modi davasrolot ai tsetskhlovani. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Gzavnili? The remedy to being afraid is fire. Uh, the cure to being afraid is fire. If you say, I don't want to be any afraid anymore, what do I need? You need fire. Anu shishi sagan gantavi suplebis gasagebi aris tsetskhli. I want to be a bold Christian. Tu shen ambob ramchir deba imisatvis rom agar meshine dos rom tkitse kristiani viqo am shemtkhovashi shenkchir deba tsetskhli. You need fire. Shenkchir deba tsetskhli. Hallelujah. I want to win somebody to the Lord. I'm gonna. I want to. I want to win. Me minda shizlebat kwen ambot me minda viqats agmertan moviqano. You need fire. Fire will compel you. Fire will move you with compassion. Sometimes it will make you weep for the lost. The fire of God. We need a baptism of the Holy Ghost and fire. Hallelujah. Amen. There's one thing Jesus said for a while it kind of I didn't know what he meant. Yes, I'm ertira met kwa da kaikhnis manzelze ver khtebodit rai ver khtebodi me rai gulis khma. He said I've come to start a fire on the earth. Man tkwa movedi rom tsetskhli movitano dedamitsaze. He said that. Man es tkwa. How I wish it were blazing right now. Rogor minda ro aichla es tsetskhli ese akashkashebdes. I say me too Jesus me too. Velbne bimetsi eso mets. Then I read this uh, verse from a version called the message Natasha Bishop Natasha she uses the message a lot. Da tsavik itkhe igive exam an igive mukhli messages vers biblis versia messages dan kartuzas. Luke 12:49. Luke 12:49. Natasha Natasha's verse. That Lucas Otris. Twelve forty-nine. I'll say it from the message, and you just interpret it, okay? Oh no, it's better to read. This is not the same from the message. Ah, all right, sorry. I've come to start a fire on this earth. Dedamit as a move direct at Cesli Movit. How I wish it were blazing right now. Oro gur vtskuri aro ayakla guz guz evdes. Jesus says I've come to change everything. Yesu ambos move divar at aqela peri shevsalo. Right side up. Pro aqela peri amovat riyalo. How I long for it to be finished. Oro gur vtskuri aro dasrul des. So he wants to start a fire in our churches. Anu Yesu vtskuri aro chen. Fire in our schools. Fire in our communities. Fire all over Georgia. Fire all over the earth. Hallelujah. 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 I want you to do this. I know everybody's tired. I've been going all day myself. Hallelujah. Well, let's stand up. Hallelujah.